Go ask his wife if she'll take um like ten thousand dollars for it or something. This is a three uh my three eighty three. Oh that's nice. Motor Scott is pretty peppy. What is good YouTube? It's your boy Boost King checking in with a video. Y'all gotta excuse the glare because I'm driving. Ma'am, you could have been went, but I'll go. Um so I actually just saw a box Chevy. I'm actually recording this after the box Chevy because I wasn't even expecting to record a video today. But um, I seen that was like, yeah, I got to get that on camera. I actually don't even like this shirt. I had on my jacket, but the jacket was too white. So I had to hop up out of that so I don't look too dark. And I just don't like wearing the shirt in public. Really didn't want to wear it on camera. And I hope this gas station got 93. Okay, they do. Because last time I came up here, um, one of these gas stations had 91. And I was forced to put it in my car because we was on E. But um, I just saw this box Chevy, y'all. It's pretty clean. So um, y'all finna see that in the next clip. And I'm not even gonna hold the intro any longer because I'm finna hop into home run markets and, and get some gas because we on E. It wouldn't be me if we wasn't on E. That's what Rail be saying. But yeah, see y'all after the um after the video. Hey right, y'all, don't have my tripod. They got a trailer hitch on here, like a tow package. I don't think it's factory. This look pretty clean though. How much they want for it? $18,500. Let me know if it's worth it. Overall, this look pretty clean. Um, look like they still drive it though. <clears throat> Get y'all a quick walk around. I think this is a box Chevy, yeah. They got a bug guard on the front. I don't know if this from Alaska, but I like the color, y'all. Um, a Caprice Classic. You see it right here. I ain't gonna count. I, I like this, but for $18,500, um, let's say Orbit Sulfur. I don't want to open it up because it got people's stuff in here. But overall, this look pretty good. Let me see if I can expand it a little bit. Yeah, man, it's a little rust at the bottom, um, like side skirts, but that's probably just surface rust. Um, man, like I've never seen a clean box Chevy. Like, I've seen clean box Chevys, but nothing this clean. Um, so yeah, it's probably worth the $18,000. They got a little paint chip right here. But that's nothing, bro. This paint is maculate and it's a little dirty, but it's still shining, y'all. Um, I'm more, I guess I'm more of a bubble Chevy type dude. I really like, um, Crown Vicks, Fords. You see, I got the boosted juke in the cut. But my cousin, my little cousin, love box Chevys. I wonder um, what that is right there coming out the grill. And then we have something on the hood. I don't know, y'all. I would cap and be like, should I buy this? But I'm not finna spend no $18,000 for this car because the bank not gonna give me a loan for it. Um, and I definitely don't have 18,000 cash and I'm working on getting a truck. So um, not finna pay for the box Chevy just yet. But yeah, they got stuff all up in this car. I don't know, it's a, overall a pretty good looking car though. Like I was leaving the uh, Chinese restaurant and it just caught my eye. Like I backed up and was like, er, let me see it. Um, looks pretty good. It got Alaska tags on it. So I'm in North Carolina. They probably from here. Well, they probably down here, but they probably from Alaska. Probably just never got the car registered down here. It have dual exhaust. I don't know if y'all can see that. And I don't got my tripod, y'all. So I'm just, y'all just got to bear with me. But yeah, like I want to look all up in it, but it's literally people stuff in it. They got the cooler in the back seat. Overall, though, it looks pretty good. The seats is in pretty good condition. And they have like a 
a bed cover on the back seat. So um, that told me the back seat probably is in good condition as well. I think the paint is bubbling right here, or I don't know if that's paint bubble or if that's tape. I'm not sure, but um, I'm not gonna play with it because I ain't buying it yet. I ain't buying it at all. I was gonna cap to y'all and be like, I'm gonna buy it, but no. Y'all just heard my plans. I'm trying to get a truck, but I mean, this car looks like it's in great condition, but for $18,000, y'all let me know. It's like, do box Chevys go for $18,000? Like, this is one of the cleanest box Chevys I've seen. That ain't that's not done up on like rims or whatever. Just for like factory stock box Chevy, or I say box Chevy, which it is a Chevy Caprice, classic Caprice, Caprice classic, whatever. It looks pretty good, y'all. Um, but that's gonna be the video pretty much, cause I just wanted to stop and get a quick walk around of this car. like man i wouldn't mind having it y'all i'm in north carolina i think this is statesville north carolina just in case y'all want to um come look at it like that looks pretty good i don't know if this the owner walking up on me but we finna see how's it going oh this your car oh yeah it's pretty nice bro I was thinking about it until I saw the price tag. A little too a little too much for me. Like it better be LS swap or something shit. Right? Not for this. Like it's it's factory and it looked pretty clean, but they gotta have some major motor work done for that price. Oh no. I feel you all night. Yeah, that's what it looked like. And if it's original, the miles better be low. What got the mileage up there? No, like. Too much. <laughs> they they smoking something. That's what I just asked. It gotta be super low. Yeah, like, and if this the paint, like, this original paint looks pretty good. Oh, yeah. Oh, you right, you right. LS swap to something pushing at least 500 horses. Not even that nice no, no, because you still see the cracks in the dash. Oh, yeah. It's been a minute. It caught my eye. I was just riding by and it caught my eye. Oh. Um, yeah. It's pretty clean.
back because I got a Seats are covered up with seat covers. It's pretty clean. It is. Yeah. This is a three, uh, a 383. Oh, that's nice. Motor. It's, got, it's pretty peppy. It runs, don't it? Yeah, it runs good, yeah. Everything works on the air conditioning. Yeah, you can get your hands in there and a tool in there. Yep, you can work on that thing easy. Uh huh. These new cars, you can't work on them. Yeah. It's, you gotta buy computers for it's, it's, you know, it's a little more than what some people want to pay, but you're not gonna, you're not gonna find one around this condition. Right. real quick. Can you crank it up for us? Oh, it starts right up. It starts right up. No. You sound good. Yeah, I bet he do. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's too yeah, cold up here. <laughs> Yo, what's up? So. This is cold. Yeah, it is. It's freezing right now. <laughs> That's why, that's why I had to stop and look at it because I don't never see one that's stock that's this clean. Yeah. It's like the cleanest one I've seen. Hopefully you can sell it for what you're asking for. Somebody will buy it. Uh, well, maybe the two of you get together, pull your money together, and you decide which one wants it. Like, well, no. yeah. Right? I get it on the weekends. <laughs> you don't see that often. That car pretty clean. And he opened the doors for his wife. Looks pretty darn nice, but... $18,000. I wasn't trying to say they smoking crack because but somebody's smoking crack. I wonder where he going. That's pretty nice though. Go ask his wife if she'll take um like $10,000 for it or something. I'm full y'all. I just ate Chinese. I got uh well I'll be home in 22 minutes. What is GPS? So I'll be home at 12:28. Um, I got to be at work at 1.30, so, yeah. Wish I could flip the camera around in the video because I want to talk to y'all.